are here at the Myeloma Foundation in support. Um, what kind of brought you here tonight? Um, well, I've, I've been touched by the disease and uh, I also understand the power of comedy to help family members and friends get through this, to help the, the, the individuals that are actually dealing with the sickness. And the concept of bringing these the comedy together like this and raising money and putting a spotlight on this particular um, illness, I, I just think it's, it, it's important. And I was just honored to have the opportunity to come and show my support and help raise money for the IMF and, and the work that, that they're doing. Um, so that's why I'm here. That's, uh, I'm hoping we can raise a lot of money tonight and uh, laugh while we're doing it, you know? We all need a little laughter in our lives. Absolutely. Also something that I think we all kind of need in our lives is a little bit of the 90s. It's not going away. No. We're hanging on to it. Like, with, what did they say? 90s grunge is coming 90s, back. 90s baby. Yes, I am a 90s baby. Yes. But one of the biggest thing that I hear is coming back that you are in charge of yes. is the Mickey Mouse Club. Yeah. Can we you tell us a little bit about this? Yes, well, it... Uh, uh, spring of 2019 marks the 30th anniversary of the all-new Mickey Mouse Club uh, when the pilot aired and we're getting the band back together and we're doing a big cast reunion May 18th and 19th in Orlando where it all began cast celebration with fans reunion uh, we've got two dozen Musketeers scheduled to, uh, to appear so far and uh, it's strictly 90s. We're inviting special celebrity guests that are 90s icons that touched the Mickey Mouse Club. You know, we had everybody came on the Mickey Mouse Club. So they're all family too. It's hosted by Joey Fatone from NSYNC, who a lot of people don't know, he was there. He was in the audience. He was my friend through high school during the Mickey Mouse Club. That's how we got on NSYNC. That's why JC and Justin, that's how they knew him. So we couldn't think of anyone better to really represent what we're doing. It's authentic, it's real. I called them, my, my co-executive producer, Chase in Hampton, who was also a Mouseketeer on the show, he called them and he was like, yes, I'm in, announce it, let's go. And we just announced it uh, yesterday, all the ticketing details. And what I'm really excited about is that the profits go to charity. We're benefiting uh, some outstanding local charities in Orlando, and we're gonna be announcing that very soon, which ones. But as well, we're benefiting um, my own Always in the Club Foundation. Our motto is once in the club, always in the club. And it was inspired by my time on the Mickey Mouse Club. And we focus on youth arts and education and entrepreneurship. So we've got some really cool stuff that we want to do there. And uh, just looking to have a really good time, um, May 18th and 19th, and just, Strictly 90s, baby. That's what it is. Man, man, you heard it here, and I am so excited, obviously. But, you know, I feel like there's some sort of special sauce behind the Mickey Mouse Club. And everybody that talks about it seems like it was just one of the best experiences. Can you kind of speak on that and speak to that, being a part of such a great, what it seems like, family, yeah. and what it's like to kind of be back there and kind of relive the, this, this, this amazing thing? That was, you know, there was 38 of us throughout the, the, all the seasons and we've spoken to like all but like three that we're still trying to find, right? And these conversations are extraordinary because some of us haven't spoken in 30 years, 25 years, 20 years, um, but there's a familiarity that happens immediately and a shared experience. We, it was our high school and you know how you feel about your homies in high school. Those were my homies in high school. Justin Timberlake will always be my little brother, you know what I mean? Christina Aguilera will always be my little sister. Tony Luca is my brother. Nikki Deloche, these, th these are my family members. And even if we don't speak, they need something, I'm right there. And so that's the spirit of what we want to sort of present on May 18th, is that spirit. And there was that also that connection with the fans. Right. We were growing up together with the fans. It was my taste of celebrity for the first time. I didn't know what I was doing, right. you know, but but we did that together. We grew together. And um, yeah, we're, that, you know, that it's, it's all about going back to where it all began, strictly 90s, all throwback, and let's go back and reminisce and have a good time. And one last question, can you announce anybody that will be coming back that was from the original season? I cannot, well, from the original season, I will say Chasen Hampton, Damon Pampelina, 
I can't say. Oh, the party, so the party people will be there. There'll be some party people. Okay. There will be some people from the party there. But definitely Chase and Hapton, who's my other executive producer. We are developing this and, and getting this thing launched. And then we're going to be rolling out announcements of the tiers in a really cool, fun way. Yeah. So exciting. And is there any social media that we can follow to, to bring, to kind of keep up with the news? Yes, our official Twitter is, and across all social media, is always in the club. Love it. Amazing. Thank you so much. Have fun tonight. Thank, Thank you. So you. Much.